which is the definition of madness so hopefully people might watch it and go a love and a warmth that if I've got that with my missus when I'm 96 I'll be well happy I will wish you that well thank you for public perception of the family it wasn't an easy time for them but uh, they came through it with with great yeah, but it's definitely hard in the sense that time's moving on and she can't quite catch up with it. Um, and she's put under a lot of pressure and a lot of. By a, by a prime minister who's probably not up to the job, you know, and, uh, and it's sad because it, it tarnished Eden. So it's quite Were you drawing any parallels between Britain entering the new era then? Well, I mean, Suez is a fantastic... You know, Tony represents that. Tony is the, the rock and roll element of London, the royal family of their family Miller. And their engagement party, I think, in episode seven. Philip's horrible. Looks like a sign of many years to live. I hate the face you get. I know he's gonna be mad. Looks like a sign of many years to live. I hate the face you get. I know he's gonna be mad. With the 70th anniversary of the day, what do you think keeps them together? The fact they can't get divorced. Um, uh, and the fact that, you know, they have a, a shared sense of humour and deep, deep love and respect for one another. Um, and I think, you know, the humour aspect for me is the thing that I've always understood as the reason why they are able to, to enjoy each other's company and, and, um, and still love each other so much. I think that, that it's dealt with incredibly respectfully in the show. I think we never make any aspersions or, you know, any um, allegations or any definite truth about what's happened. And so that's the way I feel about it, um, is that what um, history has purported we do the same we don't you know want to make it we're just treating it very respectfully oh my god so excited I can't wait I can't wait to watch it I just can't wait I can't wait to see what she does I just think she's the most extraordinary actress in, and human being so I can't wait I think they make each other laugh I think they really I think there's a good sense of humor between them and actually I think there's a great deal of loyalty that stands between them and I know they've been through their rocky periods and patches but I think ultimately They've been really united and they see each other for what they are and they, you know, there's a, and they make sure they laugh. It's key. Amazing. Yeah, really excited. She's going to be a fabulous doctor. Great actress. She's got a great uh, sense of humour and a great tone to her for that part. And I can't wait, I can't wait to see what she does actually. Look, first and foremost, whatever people seem to make of what's being said in the show, they, they just had their 70th wedding anniversary yesterday. This is ultimately a triumph of a marriage. And like any marriage, um, you know, it, it, it has ups and downs, like any friendship, like any relationship, like any sisterhood, like any brotherhood. Um, if you're close to someone for that long, you're going to have ups and downs. And, and I didn't want to, I, I didn't want the show to, to duck complicated relationships. Uh, you know, I think that one of the reasons people hopefully like the show is because, it, you know, it dares paint these people in their full human complexity.